On Wednesday, China will be opening the world's longest high-speed rail line. A giant 1,428-mile line which connects Beijing to the sprawling southern metropolis of Guangzhou and will cut travel times by half to less than 10 hours due to the rapid 300 km per hour speeds. The totalitarian state's railways ministry is seeking to redeem itself after facing scandals, including corruption by officials and a high-speed train crash in July 2011 which caused the deaths of 40 people, high ticket prices and a $80 billion funding cut for railway investment earlier this year. China is planning to export its technology and expertise to countries across the world and has close ties with a number of states in Africa and the Middle East, including Israel, who signed a cooperation agreement over high-speed rail with the Chinese in October last year. The Jewish state is proposing to build a 350-kilometer high-speed line that will run from Tel Aviv to Eilat and will also serve as a land bridge from the Red to the Mediterranean Sea, resulting in a game-changing Asia-to-Europe trade route that will compete with the Suez Canal.